from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, Seth Rollins. This is it, guys. It's now time for the Money in the Bank ladder match. And Cole, this is the one the entire WWE Universe has been looking forward to. And you can throw me into that mix, too. I've been excited about this one for a long time. start the night off than with this one. I can't think of a better match to kick the night. And from Stone Mountain, Georgia, weighing in at 241 pounds, Apollo Crews. Apollo Crews looking as determined as ever here tonight. Yeah, but determination can only get you so far, Cole. Apollo Crews better have brought his A game, too. Guys, I'd say these superstars look more than ready to get this match started. I'd agree with that, Cole. And it sounds like this arena... Check twice when I saw this match listed as our opener. I mean, it could very well have been our main event. Guys, this match will undoubtedly go a long way in determining just who is the most dominant superstar. That's what makes this match so great. These superstars... Corey, please let the viewers know exactly what's at stake here tonight. Absolutely, Cole. Hanging high above these superstars tonight will be a briefcase containing a contract for a future world championship opportunity. The first competitor to retrieve that briefcase will get to cash in that contract at any time and any place. I don't think I remember the last time he looked this motivated. Okay, guys, we're ready to get this one underway. Hideo Itami showing us how to get it done. Dean Ambrose is scaling the ropes. Hideo Itami showing us how to get it done. Hideo Itami is looking for the ending. I don't think he should get up. Oh, no! Let's take a moment to discuss Apollo Crews. 
What kind of attack, what kind of tactics are going to help him here tonight? You know, I can't call this yet. What I can tell you is these competitors have that fire in their eyes tonight. This one is going to be great. Well, he's trained all his life to be here. It's either going to pay off or not. We'll see real soon. His strikes have a little extra on them tonight. The Lunatic Fringe is one of the toughest, most unpredictable superstars in sports entertainment today. Maybe even ever. Ambrose will do whatever is necessary to pick up the win. A clubbing blow. Oh, I think this man means business. What a scoop slam. In position for a power bomb. And that's not a good place to be, Cole. Impressive show of strength here, guys. Yeah, but think about all the energy this is likely sapping. There's an excitement and chaos that follows Dean Ambrose wherever he goes. The lunatic fringe will pull out all the stops to make sure he leaves that ring victorious. One of the things that makes the lunatic fringe so unpredictable is he can brawl. He can take it to the air, and he can go hold for hold with an opponent. John Cena got him there. Oh, yeah, here's Hideo Itami. Look at this. Doesn't show any signs of getting up here, guys. No, he's taking one heck of a beating, Michael. Look at Finn Balor here. Uh-oh, what is Dean Ambrose going to do here? Incoming. Oh, and he connects. There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come on, toughen up. He's too quick for him there. Whoa, the ladder hits. Jeez, that's got to hurt. This is some great offense by Finn Balor. And Byron, he's still down after that one. Yeah, that did some big-time damage, Michael. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. He is a one-man gang in there. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Whoa! Oh, and a terrific reversal by Finn Balor. Thrown all over the ring with a strong Irish whip. Look out! Seth Rollins in some trouble here. To be expected when you combine six of WWE's most volatile forces into one match. It looks to me like he took his foot off the gas there for a moment. When that happens, you run the risk of letting your opponent back into the match. Hideo Tommy may be running out of gas here. He has hopes of winning this match appear to be dwindling in a hurry. In a back and forth match like this, he has to do everything in his power not to let his opponent gain too much momentum here. Somebody wound him up and he's off and running. He's known to have good stamina. See if he can... And there it is! Here's his chance to win this! Your whole body hurts after a move like that. This can go a variety of different ways, Corey. And almost none of them are good. Not every move is designed to get the fans off their feet. This could be beautiful in Zagiri by Apollo. He can end it here. Bang! Dirty deeds. That has got to be it. Taken down with authority. How does Finn Balor come back from this brutal beatdown? Looks to me like he's starting to feel the pressure, guys. It's all about that contract, Michael. Nothing else matters. And at this point, he needs to start focusing on pulling down that briefcase and securing his opportunity at the championship. Oh, and he's still down, Byron. Things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now. Here we go. And now, look at this. When this guy's on, look out. How's that for ferocious? It's like someone hit the repeat button for this move. Apollo Crews, such a unique hybrid of power and agility. Yeah. 
he's not looking good here, Byron. No, he's got to get up. And he's what a knee strike from the King Slayer. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Seth Rollins is rolling now. Finn Balor needs to dial back some of that Irish charm right about now. Dean Ambrose is a force within the ring. And Byron, this takes a ton of strength to pull off, am I right? Oh, you are definitely right, Michael. But you also have to remember how much energy it drains to pull off. Here's Cruz with some offense of his own. Incredible! There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know. Never say never, Cole. If his back wasn't hurt before, it certainly is now. Doesn't show any signs of getting up here, guys. No, he's taking one heck of a beating, Michael. Now there's the counter. Looks like trouble here, Byron. I don't know. I guess that all depends on who you're rooting for. Oh, this is dangerous right here. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. He's taking a long time to get up, guys. Perhaps playing a little possum here, Cole. He's making a statement here with this attack. Look at this. He lands the dive perfectly. There he goes to the outside. Remember, though, there are no timeouts in WWE. Somebody wound him up, and he's off and running. And it's an overhand punch. You can't put a price tag on landing that perfect strike. And that nailed him. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Crazy move by Seth Rollins. Here's his moment, Michael. Perfect plex. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. I think Dean Ambrose just secured this match. He's not getting up. You can't like his chances right now. Oh, and that's the second time. You don't want to get hit with that once, let alone twice. And now Dean Ambrose finds himself in a tough spot. He needs to find a way to get on the offensive, guys. It looks to me like he may have lost focus there for a minute. He was really cruising for a while. Ain't no stopping him now. He's showing some aggression with that elbow. Here it is. Neutralizes him with an elbow. Finn Balor. Big move coming. This might be the end of the road for him, Byron. Well, if he can't get back to his feet, you're absolutely right. I guess. Uh... Going to be tough for him to fight back from this. Oh, the first thing he needs. He's got the contract. He's Mr. Money in the Bank. Here is your winner, Seth. Kicking off the night with an impressive victory. And you just know the...